Hi, this is Preeti from Analytics India Magazine and today's episode is a weekly update from the world of data science. Everything from new launches, latest research, cyber threats and events that have happened in the past 7 days will be covered here. So let's get started. As always, starting with the launches, Sentry launches new performance monitoring software for Python and JavaScript. Sentry, the Axel-backed company that creates bug monitoring software for app developers, announced its latest product called Performance Monitoring. It is a front-end performance monitoring software for Python and JavaScript. The feature can reduce the amount of time spent fixing errors to a few minutes by tracing underperforming API calls and other errors back to their source. Moving on, Google Cloud launches Assured Workloads for Governments, its version of a government cloud. With Assured Workloads for Government, Google Cloud ensures that government agencies and their contractors can ensure that all data stays in its US regions. Government agencies can also limit access to Google Cloud support personnel based on their citizenship, background check and geography. Google will also enable a new support option that ensures that these users will get access from a US person in a US location with a target response time of 15 minutes for P1 cases. Moving on, Verizon partners with Airtel to launch Blue Jeans in India. Bharti Airtel partnered with Verizon to launch Blue Jeans, which is a video conferencing service in India to serve business customers in the world's second largest internet market. The video conferencing service branded as Airtel Blue Jeans offers enterprise grade security, which includes encrypted calls, ability to lock and password protect a meeting and generate randomized meeting IDs. A cloud point presence in India to enable low latency, HD video and Dolby voice and can accommodate up to 50,000 participants on a call. Coming to the next news, Google invests $4.5 billion in Reliance Geo platforms. Google has become the latest high-profile firm to back India's Reliance Geo platforms. The search giant is investing $4.5 billion for a 7.73% stake in the top Indian telecom network, Reliance Industries. The investment from Google is one of the rare instances when the Android maker has joined its global rival Facebook in backing a firm. Moving on, Uber acquires Route Match to make public transport more accessible. Uber is reaching deeper into the public transport realm with the acquisition of Route Match that provides technology services to transit agencies. While Uber has displayed public transit data and enabled ticket purchases through its app for a while, the ride-hailing giant recently announced its first software-as-service partnership to integrate on-demand public transportation with its app, starting with a bus agency based in California. Coming to the next news, researchers develop laser-based underwater Wi-Fi systems for subsea data networks. A team of researchers working out of the King Abdullah University of Science and Technology have developed a two-way wireless data connection for use underwater. Strong wireless data connections are basically taken for granted in our daily lives. From cell service to home Wi-Fi networks, but it's actually tremendously challenging to create high-speed wireless connections in a medium like water that could be very valuable for keeping underwater data centers connected with surface network infrastructure. Coming to the last news, high-profile Twitter accounts hacked in a crypto scam. The Twitter accounts of Apple, Elon Musk, Joe Biden and many many others were compromised posting messages with the address of a Bitcoin wallet promising that any payments would be doubled and sent back. Apparently, the hacker used an internal Twitter administrative tool to gain access to all of these accounts. Not surprisingly, Twitter's stock took a hit and the company will probably be dealing with the fallout for weeks or months to come. And with that, we come to the end of this video. Don't forget to subscribe to Analytics India magazine and follow this segment for weekly updates in the world of data science. See you soon. Bye.